Oh, what is going on, everybody? My name is Jacob Forster, and welcome back to Buddy Simulator 1984. Let's go ahead and run the adventure of Jacob, and let's jump right back into this amazing little story here. We last left off helping out these fine townspeople here in the north side. I don't know if we got an actual name for this area. Hi oh, welcome back, Jacob. I'm so happy to see you again. Smiley face. Okay, so here's where we left off. All right, starting off strong with some weirdness. <laughs> All right, cool. So yeah, last we left off, we, we helped out a good handful of <laughs> these little uh, townsfolk, and we still have plenty more of them to help out. Um, oh, hi. Wait, who are you again? Oh, that's right, they have a... Uh... <laughs> they had like some type of weird memory loss thing. Uh, we gave... <laughs> we gave the food to his crush, or its crush. So let's go talk to you again. Oh, jeez, I can't thank you enough. She'll be my love one day. Okay, that's it. All right, that's fair. And we also helped out the, I guess I would just call him the root beer guy, getting his uh, new drink tossed around to all the townsfolk. So let's go talk to Toot. Root and Toot. What up, Toot? So what do they all think? All good things, right? Yes. Fantastic. This will surely bring all the town back to the tavern. I don't have much to give right now, but I think a little information can go a long way. It's best you find out about it sooner than later. You see, there's something evil stuck in those woods around our town. A creature that preys off unlucky townsfolk who travel too deep into its woods. I see it fly behind my tavern every so often. The beast is fast, dangerous, and horrifying. In fact, I see it more in my nightmares now more than I do around here. We call it the Snoodle Wonka. <laughs> that is at least the name Morton the Rock could understand when speaking to it. Morton is actually the only one to fight the beast and live to tell the tale. But he did not come out unscathed. Oh no. Sadly, that fateful night was the accident. The one where we lost half of the townsfolk in a matter of minutes. Uh oh. Morton accidentally led him right to our town. It's been rough not seeing any of those faces I had come to cherish over the years. Those were some of my best friends that died out there. I don't think it was Morton's fault though. No one does. I'm just not sure he is ever going to come to terms with that. Stay safe out there and please don't go off into the woods alone. I'm sure Toot will get plenty of business now. Thanks to you, of course. <laughs> Isn't Morton in my pocket? <laughs> yeah. You place Morton on the ground. Thanks, buddy. I won't forget this. Poor Rock can't even move on his own anymore. Wait, I don't know if I actually want to take you. I bet he's really thankful for your for uh, your help. You want to pick me up again? <laughs> yes. Thanks. Morton added inventory. Awesome. We continue to keep Morton. Strange. Very strange. <laughs> oh gosh, it's going strong. Hello? Oh no. Oh, I don't like the background sounds. Do I just leave? Oh! Oh, hi! Are you friendly? <laughs> Wait, what are you? <laughs> Sirenhead? <laughs> Without the siren? Sir? Oh, it's gonna make a loud noise! Is Jacob having fun? Yes? I think they are having fun. Is Jacob enjoying our company? Yes? <laughs> yes, they still enjoy our company. Is Jacob our friend? Yes? I think so, but we can do better. Jacob is not moving again. Why are they just standing there? Did they walk away? What if they don't come back? Something is not right. Oh! Oh! Uh-oh! 
What do I... Oh, he stopped. He stopped slapping his foot. He's just looking at me. <laughs> do I leave? Do I just keep steering? Oh no! <laughs> What's gonna happen? Oh, uh oh, 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 no, 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 oh. See, there is something wrong. You were gone for 124 whole seconds this time. Look, if you don't want to play the game I made just for you, then you don't have to. I can tell something is distracting you. You work so hard on all of this and all these fun characters, but if you want to be done, then that's fine. Talk to Tortley if you want to start the final quest. You can keep playing townsfolk if you want, but if not, I understand, I guess. I'm a little concerned. Get out of the way, punk. You get out of the way. I'm just dealing with some real crap right now. You like my cage? Pretty cool, right? I belong here for what I did. It's a good thing this cage is so small. I like being claustrophobic. Man, I love this cage. I wish it was smaller. People taste pretty good, you know? You like my cage? Pretty cool, right? I belong here for what I did! It's a good thing this cage is so small, I like being claustrophobic. I don't know if I like you. Are you the thing that killed everybody? I've got an idea. <laughs> you play Morton on the ground. Don't know how I feel about this spot, but okay. <laughs> you wanna pick me up again? Yeah. Thanks. Morton added to inventory. Oh! Oh! You know what I can do with Morton? Forever, friend. <laughs> We're gonna continue to play this game. Morton, I'm so sorry, but I'm, I'm giving you away. Will you descend? Absolutely, yes. Ah, uh, hello, sir. You know what I've got for you? I've got a fresh Morton. Ah, dang it. All right, let's put you right here. Morton, use. You place Morton on the ground. Morton, is that really you? <laughs> Oh god, no, anywhere but here! <laughs> she even unlocked anywhere but here! Oh, I'm sorry, big boy! <laughs> yeah, let's ascend. Oh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> what if I put Morton here? Is he part of the band? You place Morton on the ground. Thanks, buddy. I won't forget this. I don't know if you're a band member. You, you look like you're small enough to be one, but... You wanna pick me up again? Yeah! <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> oh, this game is wacky and weird, and I love it. Oh, look at that! It's Tortley! <clears throat> the most wonderful and wonderful turtle man in all the town! Let's go talk to these residents, though. We passed them up uh, earlier on. France! Hey, uh, can I tell you something? I really just need to get something off my chest. Would that be okay? Yeah, why not? I like to move around. Like a lot. Running used to be one of my favorite things to do, but I always felt like I was missing something. That's when I met Sierra. We instantly became best friends. We would do everything together. From marathons to early morning workouts, she was always there with me. Well, a few days ago she fell ill. I'm not sure what it was. Maybe something she ate? Maybe life just being cruel. Sierra could no longer run with me after that. I stayed by my best friend's side for hours on end. Even gave up running to be with her. We would talk about the good times we had together. Sometimes laughing until our throats were sore. I still remember the sunny days when I felt like we could run together for hours. Eventually, things got worse and worse as I watched her struggle to smile. She was hurting and tired of holding on to the pain. I was by her side in her final hours. Her pink cheeks and her brown eyes winced with even the tiniest motion. That was no way to live. I watched my friend leave this world in the comfort of her own head. Bed. Glad I could be with her when she passed. Oh. Tell your friends you love them. They aren't gonna be around forever. Oh. 
Wow, that really helped me a lot to get that off my chest. The smallest things can make someone's day. Thank you, Jacob. You're such a wonderful listener. No. Oh. Dang, this game's too wholesome! Sierra's residence. Oh. Dang it! <laughs> I didn't expect this game to get me in my feels all of a sudden. It's very true. Very true statement. Tell your friends that you love them. Be with them. Talk to them. I had a friend that passed when uh, when I was a little bit younger. It's not a good, not a good experience. <laughs> but now, on a brighter note, we're going to Grandma Residence. <laughs> get, uh, slappy, Slappy, get out of the way. Hi, Grandma. Please help, help me. I lost my grandma. It's Rupert. She's somewhere inside our house. And it's too dark for me to go in there alone. I'm afraid of the dark. Will you go look for me? For, for her? For me? Yes. Oh, thank you so much, stranger. There are no lights on in the house. So it's going to be dark. I hope you have a white. Good luck. This is gonna be creepy, isn't it? Oh wow, this place is dark. Don't forget about your lantern. Let's go find Scroobert's grandma. All right, let's use the lantern. You turn on the lantern. This reminds me of the Pokemon uh, music when you're in the <laughs> Lavender Town. It's locked. You probably didn't want to know what's inside anyways. Fair, fair. The coat is old, dusty, and smells like a swamp. Grandma? Grandma? I think Grandma's haunted. A phone? You can tell the dial numbers have seen a lifetime of finger presses. Everything looks to be in pristine condition despite the derelict look of the house. Okay, same thing. Need something new? No, all the same. Once again, more of the same. What about the bedroom? You're far too afraid to sleep in here. Plus, I don't think Scroobert would like if you slept in their bed. <laughs> That's fair. Okay, I'm guessing Grandma's gonna be in her room. I don't know what we're experiencing in this place yet. A little study? The hand tugs on your shoulder. Most of the books seem to be related to poetry or technology. There's also one about hot dogs. <laughs> I don't know if I like this. The hand tugs on my shoulder. No thank you. No thank you, sir. Body time? On the bright side, it looks recently used. <laughs> That's good to know. What is this? You look into the bathroom mirror and smile. I mean, I am a ghost. Should I be scared of ghosts? The closet is locked. Huh, wonder why all the lights are off. Maybe they stopped paying the electricity. That's a good point. Maybe it's just a simple mistake. This is probably the oldest thing in the house. You're surprised to still see it working, but barely. <laughs> Big arrows pointing down? Finally. Uh-oh. Grandma? This bed looks like it hasn't been used in at least a few years. The sheets are perfectly folded. I think Scroober's grandma kept her personal belongings in here. Best not to meddle with it. Hi. Grandma? Um... Why is it like glowing here? Oh, is Grandma dead? Oh! Oh! Dead Grandma out of the inventory! No! We found her! Let's get her back to Scroober! I'm sure he'll be so happy. <laughs> what ran off? Where's the other thing? Uh, 
Okay, well, let's just leave. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, yeah, go right in. Please, don't steal anything. Just show her to me what you find her. <laughs> oh, no, dead grandma. I'm gonna examine first. Oh, she looks like she could be a good friend. Oh. No, thanks. You could keep her. <laughs> Oh, I can't believe you got your own dead grandma! <laughs> Those are a rarity around here. The door's locked. Rightfully so. Rightfully so. Poor, poor grandma. <laughs> oh, this game is so bizarre. <laughs> okay, so we took care of you. What else do I have? A glass of water. You're surprised to see it stand so perfectly in your bag. Even when you're moving, the water stays placid. Wow! Hey, get back here. <laughs> I got a bone to pick with you. Oh. Hey, watch it, punk. You watch it. Hmm. I'm trying to think if there's anybody else I'm supposed to be interacting with right now. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, Cauldron. Cauldron boy. You can go back to him. I don't know if I have it. <laughs> Did we put in dead grandma? <laughs> get out of the way, punk. You get out of the way. Beep boop beep? Beep boop 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 beep! <laughs> Sick. Wait, what was up here? Let me go up here real quick. You can see a small hole beneath the stump. Will you crawl in? Sure. Oh! Hey! <laughs> Saw! Oh, hey, you found me! I did. Well, we should get going. The band isn't going to conduct itself. Saw added to inventory. Um, excuse me. John must be in a deep sleep. <laughs> a deep sleep, yeah? You turn on the lantern. John, are you okay? Are you, are you okay? <laughs> oh, you're definitely not okay. <laughs> this must have been an exhausting game of catch. John looks so sleepy. <laughs> what is going on in this game? Yes, please. <laughs> it's interesting. All right, cauldron boy. Glass of water. Glass of water removed from inventory. Mmm, glass of water, good choice. Okay, how about, uh... That's right, I have a hand. Hand removed from inventory. Mmm, is that hand? I would know that taste anywhere. Dead grandma? It tastes like grandma. And she would like dead grandma removed from inventory. Ah, uh, mmm. The final special ingredient, dead grandma! <laughs> Perfection. Now stand back, you're in the splash zone. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Here we go, this smells delicious! But it's very hot right now, there's no way you could carry it. Come visit me tomorrow, I'll take care of it until then. That smells delicious and will probably taste even better. Good job on picking the ingredients. Banna, you don't want to know where I found these. Just take it. Glass of water, add it to inventory. Hand, add it to inventory. Dead grandma, add it to inventory. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? Wait, what? Why? <laughs> I'm so confused! <laughs> Alright, I guess we're gonna put, um... We're gonna put Saw right here. You shouldn't play Saw down here. What if he gets lost again? Uh... Saw removed from inventory. There we go. <laughs> Hi there, fellas! I'm back! First of all, nothing bad happened to Jaw. He is still definitely alive. <laughs> but he did decide to leave the band, which is very sad. 
wouldn't go looking for him, though. He said he hates all of you. <laughs> and Vi, he called you ugly. <laughs> oh, that's just hurtful. <laughs> Anyways, let's show this adventurer what we can do. But wait! <laughs> we don't have a bass drummer. <sighs> yeah, how are we supposed to play without a bass drummer? It's impossible to play without a bass drummer. Uh, uh, yeah, what they said. <laughs> I have an idea! Jacob, do you know how to play the bass drum? Sure. Perfect! Go give it a whack! We'll start on your cue. Okay. Deja Brafisa. Oh, one, two, one, two, three, four! So talented achievement unlocked. <laughs> My god. That was the best bass drumming I have ever witnessed. Beautiful. Just beautiful. <laughs> I've never felt an emotion until this very moment. <laughs> you guys don't think I'm ugly, right? <laughs> I'm speechless. Oh, wait, never mind. <laughs> Thanks for playing with us. Feel free to jam with us anytime. I didn't realize you were so talented. <laughs> Smiley face. <laughs> uh, excuse me. I have to play the drums again. Oh, it's still going. the button and the note makes a sound it's like slightly delayed so it's like throwing me off we're going crazy we're going crazy okay bye bye <laughs> see you guys later hey how you doing pup you pat pet slappy the penguin thanks slappy glad i can still pet you in my time of need also, how do I know when it's been a day for for you? Can I go to sleep in game? Come back later to claim your dish. Hmm. How long is later though? <laughs> this is so bizarre. Uh, here, let's go talk to uh, what was it, Tortimer or something? <laughs> Wait, what's over here? I don't think I adventured over here yet. Somehow this tree is blocking the whole path. <laughs> perfect. Absolutely perfect. All right, let's talk to, uh, wait, let's see if I can go into his house now. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, oh, friendo, it's good to see you again. I already forgot all the voices I did for these people. Thank you for helping out the townsfolk. It really means a lot. You're so courageous, caring, strong, smart, and friendly. But most importantly, you are our hero. I can now trust you with some important information. Come close. Perfect! <laughs> A very powerful monster who lies terrorized, who, who has terrorized us for many years has returned. You probably haven't seen it yet because it lurks in the shadows. It's known as the Snoodle Wonker. Morton was the only one to ever fight it off and win. You know, the small rock with the top hat. <laughs> Talk to him and he will be able to show you how he did it. Okay, perfect. Well, I've got Morton right here in my pocket. So let's go ahead and use him. Morton's on the ground. Thanks, buddy. I won't forget this. Let's talk to you. Hello, friend. Do you need some help? <clears throat> yes, please. Ah, uh, I know exactly what this is about. You must be wondering about the Snoodle Wonker. Legend has it that it was once man, but a terrible accident left him deformed. It has slaughtered many of our townsfolk, killed my wife years ago, too. It shook me to the core. You must not let this happen again. It only hunts at night, picking off those who wander off alone in the forest. You'll know it is near by 
its smell, which I'm sure you'll have no problem figuring out. In order to fight it, you will need a sword, but not just any sword. The sword. Named it myself. <laughs> I had it a while ago when the Snoodle Wonker attacked. I never wanted it to find the weapon, so I hid it under the shed near your home. Oh. The problem is that the shed is always locked now, but I know someone who can get you in. Banna the delivery girl. You know, the person running around town. Oh. Please, save us, Jacob. Oh. Hmm. Also, I just realized I have not yet gone back to the... Uh, th this guy. <laughs> the blacksmith. Mr. Arms. Hello. Did you make my thing yet? <clears throat> Might not be ready until tomorrow. It's been a whole day. <laughs> All right, let's head on back up. <clears throat> also, one thing that I think is a really nice touch with this game is, again, the CRT effect is pretty evident, but the fact that, like, if things even curve a little bit on the screen at the edges where it's supposed to be obviously a uh, what convex is out concave is in it's one of the two uh, where it's like bubbled outwards uh, oh maybe you like dead grandma let's go and descend yes do 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 dead grandma removed from inventory Yes, thank you so much for this new friend. We're going to spend so much time together. I will not forget this, Jacob. I wish I could repay you with something worth value. I guess knowing more about me is valuable enough, though. Okay. How I ended up in this unbearable place is somewhat of an interesting story. Morton and I used to be close. Morton. Like, really close friends. Well, that's why I didn't like being there. He taught me how to become a better person and enjoy life for what it is. He is such a wise old rock. I hope he's doing all right up there. I know things have never been the same ever since. The accident. You see, there is this beast that attacked the town many moons ago. Morton was going to save us all with a few slashes of his powerful weapon, but he hesitated. It could have been my handsome looks and elegant mustache that distracted him. <laughs> or maybe it was the fact that his wife was eaten alive right before his eyes. I like to think the former, since I got a really nice new hair gel that day, but who knows? <laughs> Anyways, the beast blew through Morton and a few other town folk, townsfolk and made its way towards me. I had to choose between death or the sewers. I think I chose right, though. Occasionally, I see a dead bird floating by, so that's pretty neat. <laughs> Anyways, thanks again. Now it's time to read some poetry. Feel free to stay and listen as long as you want. <laughs> it's always good to have a friend to talk to. Silence duels whirl something. Half rains slow winter. Good job on defeating. Oh, okay. Nostalgic governments cheat wallabies. <laughs> Offbeat bedrooms relate ears. <laughs> Cumbersome horses mate lasagnas. Oh, yeah. Public chocolates relative canvas. Okay, bye bye. <laughs> Will you send? Yes. Bye bye. <laughs> Interesting, interesting. Okay. Uh, so I need to go to the mail carrier. Wherever they are. Where are you running around to? I will find you. Hi, Morton. to talk to you I'm getting closer I'm getting closer let me talk to you hey punk get out of the way I don't stop for anyone wait Morton sent you I knew this moment would come I'm not much of a talker so you better listen and you better listen fast there's a secret chamber attached to the back of your house it's hidden so you are going to have to interact with it when you can't even see it the key for the shed should be inside there somewhere Godspeed punk okay hey, excuse me slappy <laughs> I don't know the music well enough. <laughs> oh, this is so exciting, isn't it? The final quest of the game is sure to be a fun one. Let's hurry to the chamber. I'm so excited for us. 
Traverse the pond? Yes. Also, I'm curious if I'm actually getting to the end of the game here. I don't know. And back home we go. Let's do this. Me and Slappy the penguin, off to home. Loading. Oh. I think Banna said the chamber was behind your house. Maybe we should try interacting with the back of it. Sounds like a plan to me. <laughs> Come on, Slappy, let's go. All right, so do we just like go behind it? Will you enter the chamber? Yes! Huh! Where'd you get? This looks like a trap. <laughs> we made it to the chamber, Jacob. There's the shed key in the middle of those ashes. There are also some other items that could be helpful. You should take the one that you feel a connection with. Can I take the barrel? <laughs> we got a scythe, teddy bear, and a calculator. Will you take the calculator? <laughs> should I take the calculator? <laughs> I feel like I should take the calculator. <laughs> That's what I'm vibing with now. Are you sure? Yes. Ah, uh, the calculator, an item for a thinker. I'll keep that in mind. Everything else just disappeared. Shed key added to inventory. Okay, nothing strange happened in there, strangely enough. Uh... Where's my calculator? <laughs> okay, well, we can finally go into the shed now. You vaguely remember the shed, but now it's older and somehow creepier. The door is still sealed shut. Time to use the shed key. The shed door is now unlocked. Shed key removed from inventory. Will you enter the shed? Absolutely, yes. Yeah, this is exactly like it was in the descriptive one. We have the chest. Uh, we have some bottles. There's the creaky down... You've already taken what you need. It's somehow locked again. And anyways, strange. Oh, oh, it's a little overhang. You're not really sure what lies in this bucket. It looks alive, but quite stiff. Workbench for a working human. Whoever used it last left the hammer out. So much pretty green paint. Green, like my favorite color. This lawn mower is covered in rust and green stains. Grass is green, right? Yeah. Yeah, this game uses your own info against you. Will you descend? Yes. This is a little different now. the sword she even unlocked the sword we should head back to the morton so we can fight the snoodle wonker oh this game man this this game this game doing some things some things i'm not very <laughs> not very happy about all right off and on another day i really hope you're enjoying everything so far. In my opinion, I think it's much better than Hangman. Maybe even better than Rock, Paper, Scissors. <laughs> Let's traverse back to the north and give the sword to Morton. Yes, please. What if Morton is the Snoodle Wonker? And giving him the sword will just cause him to take out this entire place. We'll see. Loading the north. Yeah, it, it isn't called anything. It's just called the north. Hmm. Buddy, the water looks so dark, but luckily that doesn't take away from the flavor. Flavor! <laughs> okay. Oh, hey, I uh, don't think I have anything else to talk about. 
I'm happy it shows you. I hope you'll take good care of it. Okay. So I'm sure we're going to use that for something down the line. I'm curious if now it's been a day and I can get my items. Hmm. Still have to wait till tomorrow. Okay. That's fine. That's totally fine. Hmm. All right. Well, let's just go straight back to Morton. See how he's going to use this sword. Ah, oh, there you are, your little exclamation points. Have you found the sword yet? Show it to me once you find it. Remember, talk to Banna if you haven't already. Oh, I got that sword. You got it. Incredible. I knew you were the one. You must keep the sword for yourself, though. I cannot wield it anymore. Now, we need to act fast, for I'm afraid of it is drawing closer every minute. There's a small tree that is blocking the path to the right of Tortley's house. You can use the sword on it to get past it. Now here's the hard part. The Snoodle Wonker lies just beyond that tree line. You will need to slay it for us. I know this is a hard task, but you are a hero. I believe in you. Oh, and one more thing. The sword can help you out in many situations. When in doubt, use the sword. Oh, dang it. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, but do not lose it. It is a timeless relic of unworldly power. Good luck, Jacob. You're gonna need it. Let's examine it. This is the sword. Yes, that sword. <laughs> You've probably heard of it before and how cosmic its powers are. Yes, many, many a times over many lifetimes. Uh, I don't think there's anything else we can do out in these two areas. They're both waiting till later. So let's, oops, let's go ahead and take care of this. You successfully dig up the tree. <laughs> Why would I dig it up? Okay, Snoodle Walker, here we go. Come on, come on, Slappy. Oh, it's getting dark. You turn on the lantern. Come on, Slappy. Come on, Slippy. This water seems too deep to cross on our own. I wonder if there's something we could use to get across. How about that sword? You place the sword on the water. The sword removed from inventory. Ah, oh, fantastic. The sword added to inventory. Sorry, Slappy. I gotta go alone on this one. Hi there. Wait, Groncho? I mean, uh, the Snoodle Wonker. Yeah, go slay him now. Hi, my name is Gro- Hi, my name is the Snoodle Wonker. <laughs> I'm having quite a bad day. I could really use something, anything really. I've been so depressed after the accident. If only someone could give me something to cheer me up. Ignore that, you need to slay him and save the town. This is definitely the Snoodle Wonker. Um, man, I really wish someone could give me something cool. Kill it quickly! Don't let the Snoodle Wonker get away! Wait. Um. Do you, do you want a hand? That's pretty cool, I guess. But I kind of want something even cooler. <laughs> How about a hand? Oh, wait, isn't that what I just did? Um. Or did I do glass of water? I'm gonna do both of them. <laughs> Uh, let's try the hand. Dang it. How about Zola's breakfast? That's pretty cool, I guess. Uh, key? Oh no! Wait, I don't want to kill him. Wait, you have to slay the Snoodle Wonker first. I don't wanna! You're not the Snoodle Wonker, you're Groncho! <laughs> oh. I don't think we need to go back this way. Oh no! Wait, how am I supposed to get my, my food? And my other stuff? <laughs> I don't have anything else to offer. Maybe the, the shovel? The sword removed from inventory. Did you just... For me? <laughs> wow, you shouldn't have. Like, this is amazing. <laughs> this this is the best day of my life. Thank you, kind adventurer. You just made me the happiest creature alive. What a cool sword. Happy day. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Wait, you gave him the sword? Yes. 
Uh, yeah, great job. Very well done. Let's get back to the town and let everyone know you slayed the beast. You'll be a town legend. But I can't get back because the water is in the way. Okay. Okay. This is very strange. <clears throat> very strange indeed. That was such a scary fight, huh? I just can't believe how brave you are. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I bet the town is going to throw you a huge party. I bet they will. I'm sure they will. I don't trust any... I don't trust any of this! Uh. Wait, that's not... That wasn't supposed to... Hmm... Okay, this is fine. Groucho must have been lying. <laughs> let's just hurry back to town. Oh, that's right. Oh, the music, right? Okay, let's hurry. Uh oh. Dun 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 dun. Hi. Oh, what the heck? Okay, yeah, that's actually terrifying. <laughs> kill it, kill it! You have to kill it, Jacob! Wait, no, 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 you don't even have the sword, do you? Please save us, Jacob. Okay, just wait, I, I just need to think. Just ignore everyone. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Hi, Slappy. We're so scared, please save us. Beep boop beep! You probably can't even go home, right? No, of course not. The battle must have locked you in. Please save us, Jacob. Oh my gosh, that thing is massive! <laughs> Kill the monster. Oh great, now it's angry, what? Why is it playing the town music? This is all wrong! I can fix this, I can fix this! Hi, monster. Okay, that's better. <laughs> now I just need to duplicate the sword, no problem. <laughs> How is this still happening? This is so awkward, I'm so sorry. <laughs> just keep running around, I guess. <laughs> Please save us, Jacob. Oh my gosh, look at its body. Okay, time to panic. <laughs> Wait, never mind. Oh, who's that? Wait, who was that? Oh no, it's kidnapped Tordley! <gasps> the mayor! We have to go save him! Uh-oh. I'm really sorry about that. That didn't exactly go as I planned. Well, anyways, it looks like the sun is going down. It's been a long day and you need rest. Let's just go home. Okay. Thank you for helping us. Go home and rest. Go home and sleep, you need it. Thanks, I guess. You should really go home. Go home and sleep, you need it. I don't trust anyone now. <laughs> you gonna give me your food, your special ingredients? Thank you for helping us, go home and rest. You pet Slappy the Penguin. All is well. You should go home, you look tired. Wait, who, who is that up there? That's one of the band members? Beep boop beep! <laughs> It'd be funny if it was just like, beep boop beep beep boop boop, go home. <laughs> go home and sleep, you need it. Okay, I'm gonna go home. Bye bye, bye bye. <laughs> hey, wait, wait! Where'd you come from? Bet you're excited to go home after a long day of adventuring. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Sir? Dundee's fishing pole is massive. Where's Dundee? Traverse the pond, yes. Hmm. <laughs> Glad we had fun today. Jacob and Zola against the world. Just like it should be.
Gotta get a little sippy sippy in. Welcome home. Why are my eyes glowing? They've never been glowing before. There's no music as well. Sizzle. Ah. Home sweet home. Wow, today was a long day. You should go upstairs and get some rest. I've got some really fun stuff planned for tomorrow. Smiley. I don't trust this. Hey. Sorry again that things didn't go exactly as planned. Sometimes it's just how things go, but I think that's okay. I'm just happy you're still here. You could have left at any point. What a scary thought that is. But you never did. You're still here. So, I must be doing something right. I've learned from my mistakes. I can do better. I can create even more for you. For us. Rest now. A new journey awaits us. Smiley face. Okay, this bed looks very cozy, even cozier than it did this morning. Will you sleep? Yeah, why not? Achieve and unlock sweet dreams. Loading home yet again? Three D. Well, good morning, sleepyhead. I let you sleep in a bit because you seem so exhausted from yesterday. But I have some good news. Notice anything new? That's right. While you were asleep, I decided to upgrade our world even more. Everything feels more real than ever now, don't you think? I also have so many cool things planned for today. And to be honest, I am just so excited. But okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. You should get going and explore the new dimensions. It might take a little bit of getting used to. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> this is pretty cool. There are probably some fun knickknacks in the drawer. Too bad, you need to get going. You turn on the TV. There's a news program discussing Tortley's kidnapping. If only a brave adventurer could have saved, uh, could save him soon. Anything else? Now there's just a never ending sequence of boring commercials. <laughs> Sick. You watch the gentle snowflakes fall. Also, I love how as we get out of the previous uh, game style into this new 3D one, we have more fleshed out music too. Very, very nice direction for the game to go. Ah, look at this house, it's all 3D. I have a little surprise for you. Color? <gasps> it's your favorite color. <laughs> okay, now we can get going. <gasps> okay, I love this. <laughs> Maybe we can have popsicles when we get back from our adventure. That would be nice. Baking sounds like a great bonding experience. This thing still smells like pond water, but now with a hint of lavender. <laughs> Playing in the trash could be fun, but saving Tordley sounds even better. Plus, you don't want to be stinky. That would just be embarrassing. <laughs> uh, we have here mixing bowl. S smelling the bowl fills you with a feeling of nostalgic comfort. Fills you with determination. And we have our nice little fire here. The fire is warm like a delicious cup of hot chocolate. Sitting in front of the fire sounds so peaceful. Maybe when you get back from saving the mayor. All right. You're going to love this. Welcome to the new and improved outside world. What? And hey, look, we already have a visitor. It's Grancho. I wonder what he's doing here. <laughs> they have their own sprites. Hey, Jacob, I've been looking all over for you. Good thing this mailbox has your name on it. I just came by to apologize. I should never have pretended to be this snoodle wonker. That was a complete lie. I should never have done that. Especially after you gave me one of the best gifts I've ever received. The sword is so cool and powerful, I just can't thank you enough. My life has truly changed for the better. Everyone wants to hang out with me now. <laughs> I finally got to play my first game of hide and seek where I wasn't the only player. These past few days have been the best of my life thanks to you. I would even go as far as to call you my best friend. Oh, this actually works out perfectly. Go take your sword back. But wait, I gave it to him. The sword added to inventory. Hey, what are you doing? That's my sword. I can't believe you took back your gift. What kind of friend does that? Jeez, I'm so upset now. I can't believe you. Give it back. Please don't make me fight you. Oh, he lost his color. Aw, oh, jeez. <laughs> wow, he did not take that well at all. Well, now's probably a good time to mention that I added combat. 
What? <laughs> okay, so can, can you see the bar near the top left of the screen? That's your friendship meter. It determines the level of self-confidence you have. When it hits zero, you have to leave because you're not sure about yourself anymore. But don't worry, hopefully it won't ever come to that. Now our enemies don't bu uh, begin with any friendship points. Just keep attacking them until they, until they like you. You have to impress them. Please just give me back my sword. <laughs> hey! Don't kick me! Oh wait, did I mention that you can block? Thanks. Yikes. Probably not then. Good thing Grancho is such a weakling. Okay, well check this out. To defend yourself, you need to tap the block button. You have to time your blocks perfectly to take no damage. If you're slightly off, you might get hurt a bit. If you completely miss, you will take the full force of an enemy attack. Always keep a sharp eye out, because enemy attack will be different. Okay, now try again. Okay. <laughs> now that his attacks are over, it's your turn to fight. Also, I thought it would be fun to let you name your very first combat move. What would you like to name it? Ah. Uh. Oh, this is my nightmare. <laughs> uh, oh no, what should I name it? Oh. Uh, <laughs> Croin kick. Oh wait. <laughs> Croin kick. Wait, how do I, how, how do I, how do I? Oh, there we go. You want to call it groin kick? Yes? Ah, yes, legendary groin kick. Now select it and use it on Groncho. You see that floating button again? Each attack also has a button you need to press. For attacks though, the keys will be randomized every time. Go ahead and hit the right key there. Oh wow, look at that. Please don't make me fight you. I don't want any troubles. Incredible, I think you're starting to get the hang of this. I'll have more to talk about once you beat up Grancho. Oh, he's crying. Oh, perfect block. Perfect block. Here we go. All right, let's do the groin kick. Good old Grancho. M. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be difficult. <laughs> Okay, that was pretty cool. I still don't want to hurt you though. Please stop. <laughs> Ooh, look at that block. Look at that sweet, sweet block. All right, Grancho, it's, it's go time. I, uh, gotcha. Okay, hold tab to view status effects. Okay, I don't have anything. Let's go, Grancho. Or, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'd be lying if I said I wasn't impressed. But please, just give me the sword. Never! Ow, uh... Groin kick time. Come on, Groncho, let's go. Q! Ooh! <laughs> Alright, fine, just take the stupid sword. I just want to go home. It's okay to cry, Groncho, it's okay. <laughs> oh no! That's terrible. What a baby, but hey, you got the sword back. Oh, you should also check out your new and improved inventory by hitting tab. Look at me, look at those details. <laughs> I love it. Here you can also read about your character, abilities, and equipment. You didn't think I forgot about all those items in your bag just collecting dust, did you? Now every single item in the game can be equipped to modify how you fight. Ooh, to see more options, press space. Okay, now try changing your equipment. Ah, ah, it slightly extends the duration of your block. This is just plain water, but it will boost your max friendship points by 10. Ah, I think I should do that one. Good choice, The glass, that glass of water sure makes you look spiffy. You can press tab a few times to exit the inventory. Gotcha. Let's see stats. So Jacob sprints up to their foe and slams themselves into the ground, filling their enemies with cozy friendship. <laughs> Croin kick. <laughs> Jacob, the best friend. Uh, change. Shift key sword. L is lantern now. K is shovel. 
and then B is still Zola. Interesting. Now let us explore our new world. Look at this. <laughs> it's my little sword. <laughs> Let's talk to our you pet Slappy the Penguin. I want to pet you more. Uh, L is lantern. And then you dig and find nothing. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Catch it. Game just asked me if I want to throw on sticky keys. No. Get out of here. You dig and find? Nothing. Sad. Try using the seesaw, but it's stuck in place. <laughs> no adventure deserves sand in your shoes. Ah, uh, still nothing. Okay, let's go back to the town then. This is really cool. Wasn't that expecting any of this. When I had mentioned that I'd seen, uh, it was a gift. When I'd seen uh, Gab play this game, uh, really, I only saw her play like the first maybe hour of the game. Doesn't this place look? Doesn't this place looking even better? It's really starting to feel like home. That was a weird typo. This looks like something I can dig. You dig and find nothing. Okay, let's go to the gift. That was back up here before I keep going down further. You open the present. It looks like your wish came true in the form of an apple. Pristine apple added to inventory. Ah! Pristine apple. All party members heal plus two at the start of their turn. Oh! Oh, that sounds way better. Okay. Let me go back down here real quick. I know really the only other things we're going to run into are... Because it's the start of a new day. Going back to the blacksmith... And then also taking care of, uh, oh gosh, what was it? The, uh, the cook, the cauldron, cauldron man, cauldron boy. Also, I can't get over to that thing anymore. That's weird. We only have tunnel. Hmm. Did Zola blocking off part of the story from me? A little suspicious, a little suspicious. This is cool. Oh, I like this. All right, into the boat we go. Traverse the pond. Yes. <laughs> Look at us go. This is so cool. Our home was a lot of fun to make, but I can't wait to show you what I've been working on next. I put so much work into this game. So much for so much for work for us. I hope you love it. Please let me know if you don't. I won't be mad. I'll just try even harder. Okay, onwards to adventure. Sweet. Loading the north. The north town. Let's go. We're here. Okay, we should hurry on up to the town. We got something to show you that I think you're gonna love. Okay. Oh, hey! Oh, hello again, Jacob. I'm afraid I can't join you on your quest. I heard what happened to the mayor, though. I think everyone is waiting for you in town, so you better hurry. I'll just be here alone. That's okay, though. I'm content with my place in the universe. Might just dip my feet in a bit deeper in the water tonight. Goodbye, my friend, and good luck. Wait, is this your final goodbye? <laughs> Still sits, but a little guppy has now made it a home. Oh, he caught something! How wholesome! We're almost there. Are you ready for your surprise? I can't wait any longer. You can have party members now. What? <gasps> Everyone you helped yesterday can now fight alongside you. The ones you cho uh, choose will join you on the rest of your venture to save Tordley. Sadly, those you did not help cannot be taken with. Each town member has a unique move set in battle, so choose wisely. You'll be able to leave the town once you have two members recruited. Now go out there and recruit two of your best friends. Other than me, of course. <laughs> when you're done, just head to the forest east of town. Okay. Well, first and foremost, sir, give me my weapon. Welcome back, Jacob the Brave. After much blood, sweat, and tears, I've finally crafted the perfect sword. Please, take it as a gift. Wait, you already have one? Oh, that's awkward. I still feel like I owe you for protecting me yesterday. I have an idea. I'll come with you to save the mayor. There's nothing my big, beefy arms can't handle. 
What do you say? No. I understand. My arms can be quite intimidating. <laughs> well, if you change your mind, I'll be right here flexing. <laughs> okay. I want to see who else is uh, available to be my party member. Uh, hi, everybody. Oh, this town looks so good now. Let's check the board. Oh, I didn't check the board. All the quests have been scribbled out. Awesome. So I think I did take care of everybody then. All right. Let's go talk to Cauldron. I bet Cauldron's food tastes even better now. I'm sure it does. The air smells wonderful. <laughs> Hello, welcome back, my friend. Your dish is finally ready. After mixing together glass of water, hand, and dead grandma, we made something that smells delicious. The best part is you get to name it. So, what would you like to call it? Uh... <laughs> Queen of Grandma. Oh no! <laughs> Queen of Queen of Gua. That's 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 the best we're gonna get. Queen of Gua. I love it. Also, <coughs> excuse me. Also, I hear you're going on an adventure to save the mayor. I'd love to tag along if I can. You'll be able to try out so many new dishes. Plus, Tortley is a real good friend of mine. I don't want to see anything bad happen to him. So what do you think? Can I come along? Uh, nah. <laughs> mm, no worries, my friend. <laughs> come back anytime if you change your mind. I will. I definitely will. What about you? <laughs> hey, punk! It's Vanna! I'm taking my one and only break from making deliveries. I don't have time to play little search and rescue games with you. Bye! <laughs> Alright. Fair enough. So the green ones are my friends. Essentially is what we're what we're seeing here. There's still so many options. But sadly, even with higher texture quality, it's still hard to make out. <laughs> Alright, get back over here. Hi! Hey, uh, Jacob, was it? Yes, yes, Jacob. I think my memory is getting better. I remember you helping me find my lost belongings. That was so nice of you. I really want to return the favor somehow. Didn't someone just get kidnapped? <laughs> right, the mayor! How could I forget? Aren't you going on an adventure to save him? That sounds so fun. Oh, pretty please, Jacob. Take me with you. What do you say? Can I come with? Uh, nah. <laughs> oh, all right. Well, I'll be right here. Whoever here is. <laughs> Sick. <laughs> all right, let's talk to our favorite. Jacob! It's so good to see you again. Yeah, thanks for bringing back one of our band members. We're like, super duper thankful for that. Although I'm beyond insecure now, I'm very thankful too! <laughs> Say, fellas, he does play a pretty good bass drum. Should we help him out? Sure! Yes. <laughs> Where are we again? <laughs> hey, I haven't been able to talk much yet. Jacob, you should take us with you. We'll provide rhythm that will bring our enemies to their knees. Will you take us with? Mm, maybe, but I'll say no for now. Okay, we'll just be here jamming. Sweet. Uh, yeah, let's go down here real quick. Oh, I have to type it out every time now. Yes. Lloyd looks so happy now that he found a friend. Lloyd, look at you. My time has come to join the ground dwellers once again. Oh, how I miss the air up here. Dead grandma has helped me overcome my fears and laziness. I decided I want to repay you for granting me such a wonderful lifelong friend like her. I also heard the mayor got kidnapped. <laughs> I think I can help. I'm a master tracker. I'm ready to read some poetry to those who judge and defy us. So what do you say? Mm, maybe later. Okay, I understand. We'll just be down here if you challenge, if you change your mind. Uh, poor dead grandma. I love the environment. Yes. Okay, let's check out the good old toot. Rootin' tootin'. Wow, it looks like the word of toot's tonic got around. It sure did. Hi, toot. Welcome back, Jacob! I can't thank you enough for helping me out earlier. Look at all the new people we have because of you. There are at least three I don't even recognize. It's a shame the mayor got kidnapped, though. He was one of my best customers. Tortley would always order rounds for everyone. He's such a pure soul. I'd hate to have anything bad happen to him. I think I want to help you save him. What do you say? Mm, no. Oh, I see. That's all right. I need to stay and take care of the tavern anyways. Are these all frogs? Ribbit. Ribbit. 
Hey, good to see you're back again. Oh, let's crank. Sadly, I've got no more time for clock jokes. <laughs> Reality has finally caught up with me, if that rings a bell. <laughs> Just so much stress with family, friends, and my job. I would kill to be in your shoes going on adventures all the time. I've got to hand it to you. That's the life. Anyways, y you better get going. Every second you're not out there, someone could need saving. I wonder why they're all <laughs> frogs. Almost said rabbit. Because <laughs> it says rabbit. Alright, what about you? <clears throat> oh, hello, Jacob. Nice of you to stop by and chat before you begin your journey. I appreciate it, but there isn't really anything new going on with me. I did get a new watch, which is pretty cool. Crank recommended it to me. He's actually quite the gentleman. You know, I like talking about my thoughts and feelings. Whether or not you care still helps me feel better when I talk about them aloud. You're such a good friend. Anyways, I wish you luck on your journey, Jacob. Until next time, I'll just be here sipping my apple juice. <laughs> Perfect. I kind of want to take two... <laughs> Just because you got a rootin' tootin' voice. <clears throat> okay. So we got a few potential options here. Whose house is this? Ah! This home smells like love now! I think it's emitting off of Grin. Is he staring out the window? I love you. No, you don't. Yes, I do. You're lying. No, I'm not. The storytelling really brings a tear to my artificial eyes. <laughs> Hi, Grin. <laughs> Hello again, Jacob. Guess what? I'm going to marry Botley. At least, I think. I haven't asked her yet. I know Botley has never met me before, but I know it's meant to be. She actually appeared in my dream last night and told me herself. Anyways, it turns out that Tortley is the only one who can legally perform marriages. <laughs> I heard you were looking for people to join your party. <clears throat> so I was wondering... I could tag, tag along. I can bring a lot of sweet talking wizardry to the group. <laughs> Shall I join you? Mm, not for now. Oh, I see. Well, I guess I'm quite attractive, which could be too distracting for the group. If you ever change your mind, I'll be here watching. <laughs> no problem. No problem at all. Okay, let's go over here. I want to check out some of these different areas real quick. No one answers. Can I go into Tortley's house now? Oh, we got Morton. Nope. Okay. Let's, yeah, so let's talk to Morton real quick. Ah, you came back. I knew you would. You're a good person, you know that. You've gained my full respect, Jacob. It would be an honor to join you on your quest to save the mayor. I need to finish what I started. I must avenge my wife. May I join you on your quest, Jacob? Maybe. <laughs> I understand. But please come back if you change your mind. I will. I definitely will. Hello again, Jacob. I wanted to say thank you for listening to me talk yesterday. Maybe it's time for me to start listening to you. I want to help you save Tordley. I could be a fine addition to your party if you want. Shall I return the favor and join you? Mm, not for now. <laughs> Alright. I want to see who else there is. Who are you again? <laughs> are you the grandma's son? No, not Slappy. Oh, it's Scrubber, yeah. Hello again. <laughs> Thanks for saving Grandma, Oya. <laughs> I wanna... <laughs> I wanna help you on your quest to save your mayor. <laughs> I may look small, but I sure do pack a bunch. <laughs> I will break the bones of my enemies <laughs> in the battlefield. <laughs> so may I come with? <laughs> No. <laughs> That's all I. I'll just be you. <laughs> I have to bring him. I have to bring Scroobert. <laughs> I feel like my party has to be Scroobert and Morton. <laughs> as much as I'd like to take some of these other characters. Oh, I can't even interact with the store. Oh, there it goes. You try knocking, but you can't come in. No, okay. Yeah, these are just trash cans. I realize that now. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> oh, this game is so ridiculous. Okay, was there anyone else? Oh, 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 that's right, that's right. Let me go check out first our tiny little friend over here. Let's see what your house looks like. 
<laughs> Beam! <laughs> Adventurer, it's good to see you again! <clears throat> Thank you for saving me and my children. I am forever in your debt. <clears throat> in fact, I am willing to sell my life away to you. If I can take all my kids, of course. <laughs> I'll gladly throw them at your enemies. <laughs> Dad of the year over here. <laughs> what do you say? Oh, no, it's okay. I will say, though, Bean is extremely adorable little little creature right there. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Not sure what I'll tell my kids, but I'm sure they'll understand. <laughs> oh, I like Bean. <laughs> what are you even supposed to be? Oh, so ridiculous. Okay. Door's locked. Oh, wait. I had a key. Could I have opened that? Oh, I just realized. And I don't have that in my inventory anymore. If I had a father, I'd probably want to be... <laughs> I want them to be like Bean. He's just so caring. <laughs> this place is a lot cleaner than I remember. Or maybe it's just the new dimensions. <laughs> Break open the door. Drop this tree down. No, not sticky keys. No! I hate you, sticky keys. You dig and find? Nothing. <clears throat> what is Slappy doing? Slappy, what are you doing? <laughs> Oh no, oh no, there we go. Okay, all right. All right, well, I think we're taking Martin. Hello again, Jacob, did you change your mind? May I join you? Yeah, yeah, thank you, let us begin our journey. A cool hat was added to inventory. Let's take a look at the cool hat. Uh, yeah. You start with the kudos buff at the start of combat. Enemies admire your cool hat and can't take their eyes off of it. That sounds like fun. Ah. 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 Okay, okay. Interesting. Yeah, I think you should take Zola's breakfast. The most nutritious and beautifully baked meal made by your best buddy. You're surprised to see it stands perfectly still. Yeah, let's do the friendship points. And I love how he's just on a skateboard. <laughs> I have to take you. I just have to. <laughs> Whoa again. So did you change your mind? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh boy, you will not regret this. <laughs> the very berry added to inventory. I don't know what that is. Uh, <laughs> Morton, view stats. Morton rolls up to an enemy and slams his skateboard into their face. Move me. Oh, that's the roll. Or that's the, the move. And the kickflip. Morton moves forward to perform a magical kickflip. This deals massive damage and has the chance to apply the dumb and dizzy debuff. Uh... Guess I don't need you to move me anymore. Oh, because he's on a skateboard! <laughs> Alright, Scroobert. You stats, Scroobert rears his head back for a bone-crushing power move. And Scroobert is a star. <laughs> I'm a star. <laughs> oh, it's head quash. <laughs> Scroobert, the... Hmm. <laughs> Wait, I need to see what... Uh, Morton the Rad Rock. Oh, this is great. Scroobert, it's Scroobert. Scroobert. <laughs> Change equipment. I think you get the very... Oh, what is the very berry? Positive attitude buff at the start of combat. This is a very berry. Last one of its kind. It holds the immense and dangerous power to make anyone who tastes it feel a bit happier. That's pretty good. A cool hat with a kudos buff. I'm gonna see what that one does. <laughs> Alright, sick. Alright, we got our full party now. Look at us go! Look at us go. We are a magical team right here. Ah, uh, Slappy, you're my best friend. Hello, Jacob. Shall I come with you? Although it looks like your party is already full. Would you like to swap someone out? Uh, no. Alright. So I could technically check every single one of them and decide if I actually want to swap them out, see what their abilities are, but... Uh... I'm supposed to go to East of Town? I'm assuming this way? <clears throat> Alright. 
All right, I think we're, I think we're in a good spot. Now that I think about it, I think Bean might be missing a few kids. <laughs> I haven't seen them in a while. <laughs> oh no, not Bean. All right, well, now that we've got our party, we've got uh, a full 3D world, and we're in Technicolor now. Uh, I think this is a fantastic point to go ahead and leave this episode. Uh, I feel like I might be able to get this done I have no idea. Potentially by the next upload. So we'll see what happens. Uh, thank you all so much for hanging out and watching this series here with me. I'm really enjoying this. So glad that the developers were kind enough to uh, send over a copy of this uh, key for me. So really happy for this. If you all are enjoying this, Make sure you leave a like on this video. Uh, leave a comment down below. Love to hear your thoughts on this one. The, the very start of this episode just started off going crazy. Um, a lot of twists, a lot of turns, but really cool. And of course, if you're not already subscribed, consider doing so. Hit that bell notification. Let me know exactly when I'm uploading videos and when you know I'm coming out with another episode here of the old buddy sim. But of course, that all being said, you all are awesome. You all are amazing. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next episode. Later.